Welcome friends. In this video, we shall solve the example number 9 of chapter 2 of class 10. And the example is as follows. Find all the zeros of a biquadratic polynomial 2x uh, raised to the power 4 minus 3x cubed minus 3x squared plus x 6x minus 2. And if you know that two of its zeros are root 2 and minus root 2. So let us see how to do this is very important question in examination point of view. First of all we shall find a polynomial whose zeros are root 2 and minus root 2 and we let that it is qx therefore qx will be equals to x minus root 2 into x minus minus root 2 this means it will be equals to x minus root 2 and here it will be x plus root 2 finally it will be x square minus 2 and we let that the given polynomial uh, by quadratic polynomial is px therefore px is equals to 2x raised to the power 4 minus 3x cube minus 3x square plus 6x minus 2 and since qx is a factor of px therefore we can divide px by qx and this means and now we shall divide px by qx like this px is 2x raised to the fourth power minus 3x cube minus 3x square plus 6x minus 2 and we shall divide it by x square minus 2 and to find the first term in the quotient we shall divide this the first term of this dividend this means 2x raised to the fourth power by the first term of the divider this means by x square then we get 2x square so the first term in the quotient is plus 2x square and if we multiply plus 2x square with the x square minus 2 then we have 2x raised to the fourth power and minus 4x square we shall write we write the terms under the same power of the variable and now we shall change the sign of these terms and then these terms will be cancelled out now we have minus 3x cube plus x square plus 6x minus 2 and to find the next term in the quotient we shall divide this minus 3x cube minus 3x cube by the first term of the divider this means by x square then we have minus 3x this means the next term in the quotient is minus 3x and if multiply minus 3x with x square minus 2 then we have minus 3x cube and plus 6x and now we shall change the sign of these values and we can cancel out these values here we have x square minus 2 and here it goes one time and then we have x square minus 2 and these two values are also cancelled out so the remainder is 0 therefore the given polynomial px can be written as q 
qx into qx is divisor into the quotient and qx is x square minus 2 and the quotient is 2x square minus 3x plus 1 and that is 2x square minus 3x plus 1 and now we shall factorize this quadratic equation by using middle term splitting method then it will be 2x square minus 2x minus x plus 1 and if we take common from these two terms then we have 2x into x minus 1 if we take minus 1 here we have my x minus 1 here we have 2x minus 1 into x minus 1 and if we put all these values equals to 0 then we have if we put px equals to 0 then we have x equals to minus root 2 positive root 2 and if we put this value equals to 0 then we have x equals to 1 over 2 and here we have x equals to positive 1 so these are the four zeros of the given biquadratic polynomial px thank you